Tim Bingham of Delta Derivatives joins us now for the Trader Rundown, and he's feeling a bit bearish on the market. Why is that, Tim? I think just the price action uh, we've seen recently here with the market kind of struggling at all-time highs uh, to make any further headway. Certainly valuations are stretched, to say the least. S&P 500, basically the highest valuation uh, we have seen over the past 25 years, over two times price to sales here, NASDAQ, Silver Story. So I just think uh, we're entering into kind of the lull of the market here. So not looking for a big pullback, but I think stocks may just come in a little here, given that run they've had and the fact that they're priced really for almost three rate cuts. I think we'll only get two. Only two. Maybe a 50 uh, in July, the market's saying one in three chance of that. I think it's going to be two quarter point and uh, call it a day. Interesting. Are you playing gold with that trade at all? Yeah, absolutely. And kind of getting a little bearish on gold here. Gold looks like a marijuana or a fake meat stock with that price action we saw breaking out. Past that 129 level, been up six straight days, up 10% just this month alone. So implied vol actually at the 100th percentile, meaning option prices are very expensive. So mm. I'm selling out of the money call spreads, give myself a little cushion to the upside to be wrong, but collecting some decent premium out in August, the 141, 144, you're getting about 55 cents for that. Finally on your list, Starbucks. Yeah, it got upgraded uh, by Credit Suisse uh, with a $92 price target. I think the problem is it's at 85 already, so only about 8% upside, even if they hit that. Valuations on Starbucks are at the highest ever. Implied wow. volatility, the lowest we have seen, so I like buying just some cheap puts out in August. The August 82 puts just looking for Starbucks to have kind of reality check here going forward. Maybe move down a bit. We will see. Thanks for coming on the show. Have a great trading day, Tim. You bet. For more Business First AM, check us out on social media. We're on Facebook, YouTube, and Twitter. And go to businessfirstam.com for where to see our show on TV.